not. There are people today who want a principle rather than to be a highway. They want a method rather than a highway. They want some way of having success rather than be a highway. But God has not called us to know the principles nor the methods. He has called us to be the highway. That it's God who comes and he speaks to us. And what we hear is the divine oracles of God. God speaks to us and God feeds us. And when it's over with, we say, surely God was with us. That's what we need in this hour. And that's exactly what we're going to have because it's what God has ordained. And the Holy Spirit shall give a revelation that God's highway, his men, God's highway, his women. Look at the gift of prophecy. What happens? Holy men do not speak out of their own thoughts, but they are channels and they are open to God. And in faith they loose their tongues and present their bodies a living sacrifice. And the gift exercises inside of them. And they choose not the words. And they know at times not the meaning. But they are there aware that God has come. And God uses them. And they speak and declare, thus saith the Lord. And it's God who's come into the midst of his people. He's used them as a highway. God has spoken. I'm amazed at how many people don't believe that a preacher can really be an instrument of God. They look at him as only a mere human being with thoughts in his mind that shares it with a congregation. And if you have a church like that and a pastor like that, God pity you. It's not God's will for that to happen. Every time I come into this pulpit, I'm expecting God to say something to you. I'm expecting God to minister to you. And I don't speak as George Bogle, but I speak as an oracle of God. I give you God's word and it shall work in you his purpose because it's his word. And it won't return void. My cry is, oh God, make me a highway so that God can come into my time. Make me a highway so that God can manifest his spirit, his power, and his glory. And I'm not alone in this matter, but every single one of you who are born again, God has called you for his purpose. I, I know not how God will use you. Other than this, I know that how he uses you will be a highway so that he can come into the earth and do what he will. Where you are, he shall use you as a channel that he himself comes into to accomplish his purpose in the earth. All right, hold on to that thought for a moment. We're going to close before long, but let's go someplace. If you are that highway, do you stop? Can you see 